Dear Mom, I know we're not on speaking terms right now, but it's been almost a year ago, and you still haven't forgiven me. I am truly sorry that I killed Alan in the fire of the house. I forgot my chili was on the stove. It kind of just boiled over. You know how I am with the things. I got really bad ADD and have since I was a child. Anyways, your son Chris. I love you, Mom. Hey, you ready to go to Matt's new apartment? Yeah, I'll be there in a minute. <clears throat> Hello, Chris. Wait. Huh? What the? Mm. <laughs> Typical reaction. Probably because you're talking to a dead guy, for one. <laughs> well, why are you here? You tell me. Well, how would I know? Well, there has to be a reason that... I've appeared to you exactly a year after, well, you know, the accident. Well, I'm over that now. Clearly, you're not. I mean, you look nervous. You, you look stiff. I mean, tell me, why are you stressing over this? Mom's the one that never got over it. She would never forgive me for killing you. <laughs> she never was one to forgive, was she? Mm. But what is stopping you from getting over this? Guilt. I see. Well, what do you plan to do about it? Live and let die, I guess. That's the spirit. I'm sorry. Well, I gotta go. So long, brother.